if it goes through, the governor of Abia State, Okeze Bazu, may be removed from office based on tax papers that were irregular. And it will probably be the biggest story in the decade in Nigeria's political scene, and arguably so too. The governor has thanked the people of Abia State shortly after the appeal court ruling, promising to do more to the people. The court of appeal in Abuja had obtained the judgment that sacks Abia State Governor Dr. Okezi Ekbeazo. Uh, let's go deeper and hear the words of the governor just before we come back and discuss this. Take your short press. We are grateful to God Almighty for what he has done that our mandate once again has been affirmed by the Court of Appeal in Abuja. This to us is a victory for the common people of Abuja State that voted massively for us in 2015 general elections. We will be reinvigorated to continue our service to Ndabia without let. We must thank God Almighty for his mercy and grace upon us, and also say that we are grateful to the judiciary that has stood as the hope of the common man. Well, I've now been joined in the studio by a lawyer, Onyebuchi Emek Manka, for an assessment of the Court of Appeal ruling so far. You saw the rulings indeed, and uh, what do you make of, of the outcome of the appeal court's judgment? Um, thank you, Gimba. Um, the, what happened at the Court of Appeal yesterday is a reaffirmation of our position from the beginning that uh, the allegations against Governor Kezi Bazu are nothing but uh, a fishing expedition, a wild goose chase that lacks any foundation both in law and in common sense. The justices of the Court of Appeal unanimously upheld our arguments that there was indeed no case against the governor. Uh, whatever allegations uh, made against the governor were dead on arrival, and uh, we thank the Court of Appeal for, for restoring uh, confidence in the judicial process and for allowing peace and tranquility to reign supreme in Abia State. Now, uh, if you do remember uh, the, the rulings from from the courts as uh, we have them. Uh, it is also important to know that uh, the appeal courts and the justices said that Justice Okonagban lacked the jurisdiction to remove uh, Ikbeazo. What is the legal translation of that statement from the opposition? Um, you see, the law is very clear on some of these issues. You need to take the decisions. There were five appeals yesterday and you need to take them one after the other. Now, the court said that Justice Oko Nabang was clearly wrong, you know, by ordering that a certificate of return be issued to Mr. Uchoga when he never participated in the election. Now, a certificate of return is the natural consequence of an electoral process. You don't issue a certificate of return to a candidate who did, to somebody who did not take part in the elections. It's just like ordering a university to issue a degree certificate to someone who was never a student in the first place. But the case is not, uh, is not, is not yet over, of course. But there is another hurdle for, for uh, Dr. Ikbeazo to cross. Do you suppose that when you get to the Supreme Court, as the uh, Uchechuku faction has said, that they will win when it gets to the Supreme Court? Well, um, at the moment, uh, is their take, is their decision, what they decide to do. Uh, if they decide to go to the Supreme Court, we'll meet them there. And I can assure you that the judgment of the Court of Appeal, this judgment is unassailable. Five justices of the Supreme Court reaching a unanimous decision. You're not very likely to go through at the Supreme Court, are you? Well, uh, it's, it's not our take. It's for them to go to the Supreme Court. We won. So if they are, if they are interested... They will go to the Supreme Court and we'll meet them there. Well, thank you so much indeed, Oyebuchi Ememanka, a lawyer, uh, to elaborate a little bit more on the court judgment, the appeal court judgment that now uh, makes Ipazu sit in Omaha as the governor. I want to thank you as well for being part of the show. I'm Gimba Umar, and that's State of the Nation.